guys, it's Mrs. Wasser. Today we're going to be learning the relationship between addition and subtraction. Let's review about addition and subtraction. We can review the concept of whole and parts. A whole is made up of two or more parts, as you see in this diagram right here. So if we apply this to an addition example, we can have um, two parts equals the whole. So we can do five plus four equals nine, because those are the two smaller parts equals the bigger number. We can also apply this to subtraction, because the subtraction is the whole minus one of the parts will give you the other part. So we can do nine minus five equals four. Now let's apply this to a math, to a word problem. If Mary reads four pages in the morning and six pages in the afternoon, how many pages does she read all together? So the first step is to underline the, the question that it's asking you so that we can determine what to do. So the, set, the question that they're asking you is how many pages does she read all together? That sounds to me like it's talking about you, that they want to find the whole. So we're going to add the two parts together. We'll do she read the four pages and the six pages and we want to get the answer which is how many pages she read all together which is ten. Now once we have all three pieces of our equation and of our math sentence, we can now apply this. We can make four different math sentences that have to do with addition and subtraction. We could do four plus six equals ten. We can also do the turnaround fact of that. By turning around the two parts, we can do six plus four equals ten. And we can also do a subtraction because subtraction is the whole minus a part gives you a part. So we can do 10 minus 6 equals 4, or 10 minus 4 equals 6. Um, now that you've accomplished this much and you did the first problem, you're able to do the, the problems that I gave out to you the worksheet, on the worksheet. And don't forget that your homework will be posted on my website, students.webhop.org slash Thanks, good luck.